SoftBank uh, had, you know, this sort of bailout plan to help try to keep it alive. It looks like now they're talking about pulling out of at least part of that. So they want to bail out on the $3 billion check they were going to write to buy out existing investors. Mm -hmm. $867 million of that would have gone to our boy Adam Newman. Mm -hmm. So I can only imagine WeWork is a complete zero now. People don't want to go to offices, right? But at least in your own office, you know your environment a little bit better. You know who your coworkers are. And then as an employer, we say someone's sick. We don't, like, there's information. WeWork is just like a free-for-all. No one's going to WeWork now. It's like a brothel. If they were going before, it's a brothel they're for not office. going now. Yeah, it is. You don't know who's walking in and out. No chance. Nope. It's Come and go as you please. Yeah. And so I just don't imagine, like, you as an individual, and no one has, a like, a long-term commitment at WeWork. It's a month-to-month for most people. Yeah, no like, one's renewing. Why would you want to go to WeWork? Mm-hmm. They might be, co- like, co-working spaces might be done. I bet Wayfair is probably doing well right now. Or steady. Yeah. You yeah. know, because people are like, I need a more comfortable couch if I'm going to be sitting on this whole yeah. Time. yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. Gosh. Yeah, no, I think people are going to go more into setting their own offices up. My friend works for GE, and they were told something like um, – just, it was either my friend GE or my friend Wells Fargo, but like, here's money, expense it, just make yourself as comfortable of an at-home office as possible. 